Hey guys, this is Anshu Sharma and welcome back again to our channel Geekify. And today in this video, we are going to be talking about how you can transfer your contacts from iPhone to Android. So if you are switching from your iPhone to an Android device, then this video is perfect for you if you want to transfer your contacts. So without wasting any time, let's first hit the intro. So I'm going to be sharing you the two methods by which you can transfer contacts from an iPhone to an Android. And all of these methods are very easy. But the first method is the king and the most easiest, which is a simple exporting method that you can do from your iPhone to an Android device just by using a VCF file. All right, on the left side, I have my iPhone 16 and on the right side, I have my Google Pixel 7a. So to transfer all of the contacts from my iPhone to an Android, the steps are very simple. So let's first open the phone app here and just go to the contact section. Now here you'll see all of the contacts that are in this iPhone. Now what you have to do is just tap on this list section here. And here you'll see all of your list of your contacts. And at the first option, you can see we have all of our contacts here in the all iCloud section. So let's just go back again. So now what you have to do is to transfer all of these 954 contacts from iPhone to an Android, just tap and hold on the all iCloud section. And once you do that, and now what you have to do is just tap on export here and it will show share 954 contacts. So you can check and uncheck here what kind of fields do you want in your contacts and what are the other things that you want to omit. Now if you want to select all fields, you can just tap here to select all of the fields and it's done. And similarly, you can deselect all fields as well if you don't want any. So for now, I'm just going to select all fields and then I'll just tap on done. And this pop-up will appear. And as you can see, our contact card has been made. Now we just have to share this contact card from our iPhone to our Android device. So what you can do is you can share this file via email. So for that, just tap on the mail app here. And here add the email that you want to share it to. So let's add our email ID here, which is currently running in this Android. And right here our VCF file which is of 1.9 MB is also added. So now what we have to do is we just have to tap on this send button here. And now the email has been sent from this iPhone to this Android device. So let's check it by opening Gmail here. And as you can see our email is present here. So if I just tap on it and let's open this VCF file. And once you'll open this VCF file it will automatically ask you to save imported contacts to either to your Gmail account or to your device natively. But keep in mind that when you select device the contacts may not sync or be available on your other devices. So it's generally advisable to save all of your contacts to your Google account. So that way if you again switch to another phone then this will help you out. So let's just tap on this email ID here and it's written here that all iCloud.vcf will be imported shortly. That means all of the contacts will be imported shortly in this phone. So let's now check. Let's go to the contacts here. So as you can see all our contacts have been added in our Android as well and they are pretty much in similar order which is pretty amazing. So cool. Wow. That was our first method and it is one of the easiest method that you can do to transfer your contacts from an iPhone to an Android. Alright, now our second method is to use the Google One app in our iPhone to sync contacts. So that way we can use all of the contacts right here in the Android version as well. So for that we first have to install the Google One app in our iPhone. So let's do that. So here on my iPhone, let's just go to the app store here and let's search for Google One app. And let's install the app. Now let's open it. And as you can see, my account has already been signed in. So first you have to sign into your account. So just tap here on the setup option in the sync section. And here it is the setup iPhone sync. So it basically makes your iPhone and Google account work better together by automatically syncing your photos, contacts and calendars. But for now we just only need contact. So let's just tap on contacts here and let's just check the status. Allow full access. And as you can see our contact sync is off. So here the sync status has shown that our iPhone contacts are not synced to our Google account. So let's just tap on setup sync. And now we just have to upload our iPhone contacts to the Google account. So let's just upload all of the contacts. And the process is going on to upload all of the 954 contacts in our iPhone onto our Google account. And as you can see in just few seconds all of our contacts are uploaded. Now let's just tap on next. So now here you just have to follow all of the prompts that are given in our step 2. So let's go to the settings app here. And here go to the app section here and now just go to the contact section here and just tap on contacts accounts and here you have to add your gmail account so just tap on add account and here tap on google and just add your gmail account here and once you have added your gmail account then it will ask to sync mail contacts calendars or notes to your iphone so since we have to move contacts 
make sure that context toggle is turned on and once it is done just tap on save and your gmail account has been added now again go back to the google one app and we are done with this step and now we just have to check our status again so it's now currently checking the status and this can take up to 30 seconds so let's wait and watch so as you can see currently our google contacts are synced to our iphone but we want the other way around we want iphone contacts to sync to google so again just tap on setup sync skip upload and here it will ask you to sync google contacts to your iphone just tap on next so again you just have to follow the prompts that are given here so again go to the settings app and here in the app section go to the contact section so once you're in the contact section here just scroll down and here tap on default account and just select gmail as your default account and once you've done this now go back again to the google one app and here again tap on check status and boom it's done super easy now your iphone contacts are also synced to google so that way all of your contacts in your iphone will automatically show in this android device as well so now what we have done in this iphone and to confirm it in our android as well you can just go to the drive app and here tap on the three lines here just tap on settings then tap on backup and reset and scroll down here tap on google account data and here you will see the option of contacts and the toggle is turned on and it's also seen that the contacts was last synced on 14th october 2024 at 5:45 pm which is currently the same timing here just one minute later so which basically confirms that our contacts are now synced so any contact that you save in your iphone will automatically be present in this android account as well so as you saw that was our second method i know it was a little longer and it will require a little bit of patience because it requires lots of steps as well and that is why in the beginning i said that the first method is super easy and convenient but having said that these are the two best methods by which you can transfer your contacts from an iphone to an android without any problem if you have any questions do let us know in the comment section and if you've reached it then definitely like this video share it with the friends and family if this video helped you and of course don't forget to subscribe to our channel that is geeky fight and with that i'll see you guys in the next video till then keep enjoying your life and let me also enjoy my life because i need to enjoy my life otherwise i'll be dead